Here's how you hook up a Mimo Light Z-Wave bridge to your Mighty Mule. Hopefully you can see this, let's zoom in here. So you can hook up the two wires, one, two, and it's a little hard to see, but let's see if I can get this here. There we go. Okay, sorry about that. So we have green. Um, just make note of it green on com and then uh, red on NC. I think you can use NO as well. Normal close and normal open, I believe, is what that stands for. Could be wrong. But this works. So then you have this wire running right inside here, back, 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 and then it goes in here. So you have a com and a cycle. Green is the calm, which matches the Mimo, and Cycle is the red. This is a dual gate opener, but um, this sh should apply to the single gate openers as well, the controllers. And then for reference, this is the receiver for the antenna, for the uh, push button in the car and with the remote control. So this is just two wires. And then I ran the power through down here to the bottom. Let's see if it works. This is smart things. Ooh, this thing does not want to focus. Unlock this now. Okay. Sorry, this is probably the worst video I've ever done. Okay, let's hit gate. Okay. So it's working. Um, didn't have to adjust really anything. This worked basically out of the box. You just have to wire it up and add the device as a switch. Just an open and close switch. So um, I don't know if there are is a custom device within the SmartThings API. One thing to note though is like when this says off and on, so off doesn't really mean anything. Um, let's see if I hit off. Okay. Oh, interesting. So maybe it actually changes the status once the gate finishes opening. I didn't realize it did that. Let's see. No, I guess it does. I guess it doesn't actually do that. So the status stays on. So if I wanted to adjust the gate again, open or close the gate again, or stop it midway, you have to hit on, and so it's in the off status, and then you can hit off again to switch it back to on, and that triggers the open, so. There's really no, I guess there's no such thing as the on and off for. No. Yeah, I guess there's no, there's no exact on and off for the gate. It's not like it knows when it's open or closed. Um, without another sensor, so I guess that's similar to what you do with a tilt sensor with a garage door opener. Anyway, sorry this video kind of sucks, but uh, at least you can see how to hook this up if you want to connect your Mighty Mule gate to a Z-Wave um, setup with your smart things or any other smart um, Z-Wave smart controller.